Hello. Hello, Maya. Hello, Christopher. Uh, we are in Florida, approaching Miami. Um, and we're on the way to Miami. And uh, here is the South Florida Science Center and Aquarium. And it's already, and it's very warm actually and humid here. So let's go inside. these fish are called look down and really they look like and looking down and this is a spade fish uh, this is a spade fish Atlantic spade and they're so glittery okay. what are you guys doing here? feeding dinosaurs oh we get the dinosaurs Yes, uh, actually you picked light crayons, you see? In this place is where the darker crayons are. Look at my time. Yeah, it's seen better. Okay, first look, here's... Wait a minute, Maya. Look, there's a... Whose skin is it? How do you think? Maya, whose skin is it? It's a crocodile. crocodile skin, yeah. A bear and a crocodile. And what's that? Yeah, and then here's a leaf. Maybe a purple. Puma. Okay, my explain guess what it is. I think it's a long bow. Yay! What is it? It's a tooth. It's a big, big, maybe it's some whale's tooth. How do you think what it is? What is it? Ooh. Is it a Who piece, piece of wood? We put this crayon in. Okay. Guess, make a guess. I think it's a friendly pet fish. This is a coral. Rain coral. And guess. Starfish, let's see. Yeah, wow. it's a starfish. What is it here? And here is the pool. Yeah. And here are different eggs. And here are different minerals. And here are minerals too. Look at this beautiful shell. It's so pearly. And Maya, pick your favorite favorite oh, butterfly. This one. 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 Now you've made the body of white hair. Hey, I'm gonna use like. Uh, that's good. Okay, let's go ahead and get it. Let's get some, now let's get some fins on for you. 
Wait, wait, wait. Do you, do you want to call your friends? is made like about space astronauts and everything since we're kind of not far away from Kennedy Space Center and um, we can see what kinds of what kind of um, food astronauts have Okay, what about sandwich? What about the sandwich? Eating in space can be a tricky experience. Your food floats away if you don't stick it down and must last for months without a fridge. Food is chosen carefully for taste, nutrition and, si and shelf life. Here you can check your reaction time, how many seconds or milliseconds it takes to press the button. So, and here's the thing, we, just yesterday we were looking, like uh, observing the launch of the rocket and here we can now almost um, experience it, it ourselves. So here we are starting, we can sit here. Yes, okay, we're sitting in the shuttle. And we are almost ready to launch. Okay, the, che the checking everything. Okay. Look, the, the, they open the rooms. Okay, we're ready, almost ready for the launch. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Okay, we are launching. Okay, 
and the vibration stopped and it's so nice and calm now and beautiful we see the earth released boosters yes we did it <laughs> uh, we're in open space that's so cool here we can here kids can explain ex experience and feel the g-forces when you when you, you need to. start twirling, you will feel the G-force mm -hmm. and try to do that as fast as you can. Do you feel the pressure? Uh, it, you come a little bit too slow. Here we, we can see the small space, space capsule, it's called Mercury, it's the old one, it was created for training but they say it could have flight, and uh, look, there's not a convenient place to be, right, it's not a vacation being an astronaut, look how tiny is it, it's just sitting there and that's it doesn't look very comfortable. Here you can try astronauts gloves. It's a little bit not so convenient, right? It's hard to do anything. Yeah. But it's a big work, right? Here you can try see what's your what your maximum uh, maximum uh, height could be in in space they say that uh, you see you can become three three percent taller because uh, without gravity your disc between your vertebrae can relax and expand I didn't know that 